Hi guys, Shadow6 here, welcome back to the Mods of the Zone. Alrighty, we are back with Yoctosphera mod. I have spoken to Mr. Hamphy, he's helped me out a fair bit with, uh, yeah, the problems I was having with the first part there. I kept crashing all the time, so hopefully this has fixed things. He has released a little bit of a fix as well, not just for me, as in for the mod in general. So hopefully that will fix a few other problems that people may be having. But for now, I was having just crashes for God knows what reason, and the number one thing that stood out is that I was running this mod through the Steam version of Clear Sky, and he told me outright is that it's not 100% compatible with the Steam version, so it's best to use the disc uh, retail version. So what I've done is I've now installed the mod into the retail version, and We'll see how we go from there. Hopefully we can get a few more parts out for you guys and continue with Yoctosphera because it did seem like a quite a popular mod. And I was a bit disappointed that I had to give it up so soon after one part. So this will be part two and hopefully we'll continue on. So what happens is obviously, obviously I have to start a new game. So what I'm going to do is do what I have to. You guys won't see all this but we're going to go back to where at the end of part one I was heading towards the church from what I last saw. I was heading towards the church in the Clear Sky uh, Swamps area. So I'll see you guys once we get to that part and we'll continue on from there. And hopefully we don't have any more crashes and that problem is solved. Alrighty guys, we're up to the part finally where we head off to the church. Just had to get rid of a few bandits here. Just as I was about to head over to the church, a few more bands decided to rock up, so took care of them. Okay, I'm a bit getting a bit overweight with the loot here. If only there was a stash box I could use at. Okay, these guys are ready to go. We'll head forwards. First thing to comment also is that the game hasn't crashed yet. So using the um, disc version is obviously a big fix straight away. Nothing I've done so far has crashed the game so I'm really happy about that. I said disc version too guys but I actually am using the uh, GOG or GOG version where they had a little deal where if you gave them your, not gave them but you submitted your uh, your retail CD key, game key, to their website. They'll give you for free the DRM version, which is a no. You don't need your disc. You just install it, and here it is. Oh yeah. How about giving me a machine gun? And they're off. Okay, these guys are cleaning up without me. I can at least try though. Don't need our stalkers falling. But yeah, using the GOG or GOG version seems to be okay so far. No crashes yet, so it's probably the same as a re probably the same as a retail anyway, which I'm happy about, as long as it works. Oh god, you guys are still here! Oh shit, they're really coming in. Stop pushing me out in the open. <laughs> oh my god. The stalkers. Lots of push and shove there. That's it, nice shield, fellas. Like you're the human shield or something. Okay, drop off some stuff. Would be nice if we can use this case. We never can. Keep pressing the wrong button there. 
Anyway, so glad that um, Yokosura is up and running. Everything seems to be running well, no crashes as I said before. Oops, other than killing myself. Oh, why? Why? Okay, ammunition I really don't need. I'd like to sell that. What I'm going to do, guys, a lot of wasting your time as I do, but I'm going to run back over there, drop off some of this stuff, and then we'll move on over to the um, burnt farmstead there. Once again, the zone is about making a bit of money too, and you make money by selling stuff, so for me, I've got to sell some shit. As always. There's money to be made in the zone. Anyway, I'll see you guys once I've done all that. Alrighty guys, we're off to the burnt village now. And, oh. <laughs> quick and easy. Anyway, off to the burnt village. Got all my stuff out of the way. About 10 minutes wasted there. And we got bandits in here, not bandits, um, renegades. Oh, we have a full stalker as well. Right. Has this already been done? This is my point proven as well as I was seeing in the first part that I've done Yoctosphere before. And about my gripe about clear sky is that when you're coming in here, you want to be a part of these takeovers or raids if you want to call them that yet as soon as you come out into the swamps it seems like most of it's done already and I find that quite annoying like this one for example come in here haven't had a shoot up anybody and it's already done a lot of the stuff here is already done I don't know about you guys but I find that somewhat annoying it's like I want to play the game in that sense And it seems like just everything is done. Oh, well, we'll move along then. We'll see what we have to do. Okay, so we've got the machine yard, and it seems like. Okay, there's already clear sky there. Maybe we should go help them. Oh, it's over here. Where am I heading? This is head the complete opposite direction. <gasps> Definitely got more than enough ammunition. As you see there, I've got 390 rounds just for this handgun. What have I got? My... Yeah, 398 rounds for my shotgun as well, so I'm not doing badly on ammo. My med kits aren't that bad either. So, so far so good guys. Nothing has crashed. Nothing has crashed. We are doing well. Stay down. Oh, why not? Why not pay attention to that? This time, pay attention to the grenade marker. Shot to the face of a shotgun. Oh, I love the dialogue. I don't say damn you bandits, but they're renegades. But they're just as scummy.
No, not the knife. I want a shotgun. Close range tactics. Yeah, I bet you're a shotgun to the face. There we go. Is that all of them? I think we got them all. Keep on guard. We've captured the rising land. All we need to do now is take control of the cards to the spots. You ain't all dead over there, are you? Ah, uh, yeah, they are. What I'm going to do is dump my stuff in this little box here. Oh, there's heaps of stuff. There we go. Okay, we're going to dump that off. Or we dump that off, I should say. Grab all this loot. Because that's what I do. Now, once this is done... What's good about having that uh, guy just around the corner there? Okay, I'm overweight. What's good about having this guy just around the corner is that I'll have that stash box right there, so I can just go straight to the stash box, straight back to the clear sky base, sell it off. I've just got so much stuff. Maybe if I eat something. There we go, something to eat's probably good for him as well. Yeah, having that guide there is good because you can just run backwards and forwards, selling off all your shit. He was a good stalker. So what we'll do now is... I might have to go up to that top corner there, take out the... I keep saying bandits. You know what I mean. The renegades. Go take them out. Alrighty. Good to get some rounds for my rifle finally. Yay, I can finally use my AK. So happy about that. And we oh yes. This base is well equipped now. We've got all the clear sky here. Okay, what to do now, guys? Sorry, I'm a bit all over the place. Okay, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go sort this corner out here, and then I know we've got to go do that. One thing I don't like about clear sky is how you feel rushed through the areas. Like at no point do you have to go through any of this. You got this whole corner up here that nothing gets done with. There's no need to go there. I'd like to see missions in these areas. I think I've said that before with other clear sky. Uh, mods that I've done. And I'll go a bit of a shooting spree over here. I'm going to use a handgun because I don't really want to waste too much ammunition on the AK there. This has like no accuracy. Okay, now we're getting some shots in.
These guys are just as... about to say, just as a bad shot as I am. Yeah, anyway. You know what, bugger these. That's dropping them. Why stuff around in the handgun? This is dropping them now. Renegade assholes. Bandit assholes. Hey, you sneaky bastard. Just die already. Is that all he is? Once again, do my looting. Actually, I just realised there is no point to doing this. Because they're just going to respawn in this area anyway, or they walk from over there. And I realise you don't actually take over that pay, uh, that base over there. It's the southern one that you've got to do. Okay, so no one loots, loots my box anyway? here. So that's pretty cool. These farms are now under our control. Good job, boys. You did it. All squads, dig in at key positions and wait for further instructions. Ah, point proven again. Here we are, just... They're saying this area's been taken over. I didn't even get to go over there. I was just at the machine yard. I thought I'd come back and, you know, do my usual selling of shit. To get ready to go to the cordon. Because there's not much else going on here. And they go and do it themselves. And why have I got that out? I don't know. But I'll be back once again once I've done all my selling of stuff. I just thought I'd quickly mention that while I was here. That the little pop-up came up saying that part of the mission was done. I don't know. I just find that somewhat annoying. It's like, I'm meant to be out there doing it. But they don't let me... They don't give me time to go do it. Alrighty guys, I've come to the southern uh, southern farmstead here, just, um, yeah, came straight here, once again, as you'll see, the clear sky guys have pretty much cleaned the place out for me, I've done all my looting, stashed my stuff in the box in here, oh, found this one, but yeah, once again, a little disappointed that I didn't get to do anything, I feel like I'm really getting pushed through the swamp parts here, which is quite annoying, I feel like that's all I've said this whole part. I've left a whole bunch of ammunition back uh, for my handgun here back at the base. I just dumped it all on the floor. I just had way too much. But 113 rounds is fine now. I've just saluted these guys and got that amount. Anyway, let's see what we have to do here. Okay, so you can take us to the cordon. But we don't want to do that just yet. I don't know. I find it like I don't want to rush. I'm going to go around here a bit more. Well, I don't know. Sort it. Look at this area. I don't know. I'm I don't know guys, should I be going to the cordon, or should I um, have a look around here? What I'm going to do though is leave it at that guys, it's only meant to be a short quick recording. But I was hanging about uh, here at the southern, th southern farmstead, and we'll move on from there. Probably should just go off to the cordon, because there doesn't seem obviously much else going on here at the uh, clear sky swamps. But anyway, thank you for watching. Please leave your likes, comments down below. Let me know what you think of Yoctosfera. And subscribe if you guys want to see more. Thank you for watching. I'll see you later.